What's up guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to check your battery cycle count on your iPhone in iOS 16. If you don't already know, your battery cycle count is the amount of times your phone has charged from 0 to 100%. So 0 to 100% would be considered one battery cycle count. 0 to 50% twice would be considered one battery cycle count as well. By knowing this information, you'll get a better idea of how healthy your iPhone's battery is. But having said that, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go into settings. From settings, scroll down until you see privacy and security. Scroll down once again until you see analytics and improvements. You're going to want to make sure that share iPhone analytics is toggled on. If it is off, go ahead and turn it on and you might have to wait a few days before being able to proceed to the next step because your phone needs to collect the data that we're looking for. Next, you're going to want to go to analytics data. On older firmwares, we'd be looking for the file called log aggregated. However, on iOS 16, this has changed and now we're looking for analytics and you're gonna to want to click on the one with the most recent date from here you can go ahead and copy all of this text and paste it into notes however I haven't been very lucky by doing that it's so much text that it doesn't let me copy the entire thing my settings app crashes before it allows me to copy all of this text so instead what I've been doing is hitting the share button on the top right corner scrolling down and then hitting save to files you can go ahead and save it wherever you want in your files I'm gonna go ahead and leave it on my iPhone hit save again on the top right corner of the screen and now it's gonna be in the files app as you guys can see it is right there however if you go ahead and click on it it's not gonna actually allow you to go ahead and read the file so from here what you're gonna want to do is go ahead and long press it rename and we all we want to do is go ahead and change the format so we're gonna go ahead and delete everything until we get to this point and then put dot text it should look like this go ahead and hit done you'll get this pop-up saying if you want to keep dot synced or use dot text we're going to use dot text and now we're able to go ahead and open it up and view all the information and really what we want is to be able to go ahead and use the search bar on the bottom right corner then you're going to want to type in last underscore value underscore cycle count hit search it will highlight in yellow and you'll see it right here last value cycle count and then the number right next to it is going to be our battery cycle count so as you see on this device it is 80 and this is an iphone 14 pro max so i have only had this phone for around three to four months but i do use this phone every day a bunch but that basically sums up the video i hope this was helpful if you enjoyed it please smash the like button it really does help out a lot subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in the next one Peace.